Reverend Dr. Joseph Lowry died Friday night at the age of 98. CBS 46's Ayani Hughes was at Cascade United Methodist today, and as she reports, it's a church significant in Dr. Lowry's life. Unfortunately, we've lost a profound leader of the civil rights movement. The Cascade United Methodist Church wants to be sure Dr. Lowry's legacy is never forgotten. We ain't going back. We've come too far. Reverend Dr. Joseph E. Lowry was a father, a pastor, a friend, and most importantly, he was a leader. After 98 beautiful years, he peacefully passed away. While the attention of the world is on the coronavirus pandemic, many shifted focus to honor a legend. Dr. Lowry would grab your attention with his charisma and... Although a physical service is still prohibited, Pastor Muriel virtually dedicated his service to Dr. Lowry's legacy a former pastor at Cascade United Methodist. He was compassionate and he cared deeply about those on the margins of society. Throughout his life, Dr. Lowry was steadfast in his life of activism, often referred to as the Dean of the Civil Rights Movement. Only his renown, his personality, his spirit is big enough to interrupt international news and become a bigger story than COVID-19 as many virtually took time to reflect on his life, you can't help but wonder, how do you come together to pay homage to a civil rights icon in the middle of a pandemic? Got to do it. Doc was here this morning. If Doc was in the pulpit, if Doc was proclaiming the word of God, what would he say to the people in the midst of pandemic and in the midst of turmoil? While funeral arrangements may be unclear, what is clear? Pastor Dr. Joseph E. Lowry's selflessness, service, and leadership will never be forgotten. In Atlanta, Ayani Hughes, CBS 46 News.